Round one. Ready? Go! What's going on guys? What's good with you? Welcome to the Health Fizz Queens Vlogs. That's our new name now guys. We took out Smoothie Queen team and all that. We took out Smoothie and team. But we like what we named it. Where, where it's at now. So that's what's up. Hope you guys like the new name. <laughs> Come in if you do. Uh, this your girl see me. And guess what? As you can see, I am back at the store Aldi for that matter and I had to make a run back to the store make a trip because we are tearing food up in that house left and right okay and since we don't really eat meat meaning we don't eat meat uh, me and Gabby and Nanai Queen Nanai but Queen Amiria and Queen Lily do <laughs> okay so they don't really eat it they just eat it a little bit they doing way better though they still will eat whatever we fix even if it's all vegetables they'll eat it so it's not a big deal but share what I have uh, in my buggy here are some of the things that I got guys uh, some pecans once again I've been tearing these up <laughs> I have some baby spinach organic okay I usually get the mixed kind but they didn't have it so this is good also, I have the organic brown cage-free eggs, okay, and I had to get some more tomatoes. These are organic tomatoes, okay, I don't like to get the other ones. And I got another box of some tropical mango cereal organic. Of course, they like their snacks, so they do eat these. We do get healthy chips from time to time, so or we'll, you know, have both. Got um, some donuts I've been craving. I got the black bean vegan veggie burgers as well as the I always say that name wrong I've been saying quinoa that is not quinoa I cannot pronounce that word right now so I'm not gonna worry about it just yet <laughs> so we have them as well as the kale veggie burgers and um, I have some vegetables here sometimes they like to eat these uh, lasagnas which is very little meat I mean very little so it's not much in these at all that's very scarce for the girls that do eat a little bit of meat we have some oranges and I want some red potatoes got some red potatoes here okay and some guava kiwi we keep those orange juice some more vegetables and some onions and I'm not done so still got a few more things to get but I'm feeling good. I hope you guys are feeling good too. I did my breathing before I left the house and my meditation and I'm feeling awesome. All right guys, so I'm gonna get ready to check up out of here. I think this is all I'm getting getting here. I'm gonna move on to Kroger's and get a couple more items. So I'm gonna see you guys in a minute. Okay guys, I'm finally back at the house after my second trip to the grocery store this month. Okay, my second haul of food all right but it's all good we need it okay i didn't get as much as i did the first time but it's a fair amount you know so all right i'm gonna share with you guys the stuff that i got i may go over some things that you guys already seen but i'm just gonna skim through it okay guys starting with the frieza now the stuff is put up because i've been here for a minute so i kind of knocked some stuff down and been digging through here trying to get some stuff where you guys can see it so I had to dig some stuff out so here's our chicken patties I believe you guys seen those before vegan as well got a bunch of vegetables back here we also like our chicken nuggets 
veggie chicken nuggets, uh, non-GMO, soy free, vegan, all that. We, we shared that with you guys. We got some kale, veggie burgers, vegan. We got the black bean, chipotle burger. All this is excellent source of fiber and calcium. And we have these veggie burgers. I said the name wrong last time. I cannot say that name right. Believe it or not, they have some veggie sausage links. These are good. And they also have veggie hot dogs. As well as veggie grillers. Okay? We're crazy about these. These are good. Alright, and in here we still like our hash brown and fries. It's uh, some shrimp in here. We got some shrimp that we're gonna cook. We got um, a lot of vegetables in the back. These are veggie chicken strips. Okay, so there's a lot of stuff in the back back there. I'm not gonna pull out. We got all our smoothies, uh, bags of fruit here. We have more of those, a bunch of those in the back. There's some. Okay, so I'm not gonna dig through all of that anymore. All right, and in the refrigerator part, we have almond milk, kiwi, and guava juice back there. We have a, um, organic vitamin D milk, whole milk is good. Can't hardly taste any difference in that. We have some olive oil butter, mayonnaise as well, olive oil. And one of my, every now and then I'll have one of those kefir smoothies. Got some court pineapple already. And we usually have the whole fresh pineapple because we like to boil the core and drink it like a tea. Um, Got to work on our cheese. But we do have the organic cage-free brown eggs. And um, some leftover pizza. Veggie pizza that I had. Yummy. I need to kill that. I need to squash that right quick. We got some organic tomatoes, guys. All right. Veal peppers, onions, uh, yogurts. There's some yogurts back through there. All right. And that's going to do it for the refrigerator. We also have some organic tropical mango cereal, fruit and nut, granola cereal. I'm missing a couple of boxes of cereal. I got to find those. Veggie chips as well. They like to have, you know, different chips. We have some organic bananas and some oranges. And I told you I have my pecans. Woo! -hoo. All right. So, all right, guys, that does it for the food. But hold up, not so fast. I want to share my hashtag kitchen friendly. At first, I said fridge friendly, but kitchen friendly is basically everything, and that includes your refrigerator, right? So, that includes everything in the dang on kitchen. All right, so you want to put healthy things in your kitchen. That's where it all starts at, right here, guys. Okay, the two most visited places in your house is the bathroom and the kitchen. You can't tell me you don't find yourself doing one of these numbers. Who don't find themselves standing in the refrigerator door thinking about what they want to eat? We do that so many times. The door just be wide open, you know. I see so many people that do that. Got that habit. Okay, so you want to put as much healthy stuff in your kitchen as possible, right? It starts here, okay, I would slowly transition into getting healthy things as much as possible. And we do have some things that are not all that healthy too, guys, which is okay. Because you know what? You eat that in moderation, all right? And you have to do moderation with just about everything anyway. You're eating healthy food, and you have to have a balance in life, period, right? Okay, so just think about that you never know you might get really good at it we're slowly getting better with this over time since we are no longer eating meat okay so it's really interesting and I'm having fun on this journey all right this healthy journey all right so with that said I want to also say I want you guys to comment below if you noticed something differently about me I did something differently to myself so come in and let me know what you guys noticed I want to see those who pay attention observing okay all right so comment that guys see how many of you get that right all right. Also, I want to say I have something else I want to share with you guys. I'm oh, sorry, something fell. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to share that with you in a minute. Okay, guys, I wanted to share something with you guys that I am trying for the first time. Me and Gabby and pretty much all the, the kids. <laughs> okay. 
All right, so it's kind of funny and ironic because a couple of days ago I was just telling Gabby that I think they ought to make some kind of a veggie chicken wing. I don't know. So I'm out shopping, get my second wave of groceries. And why I run into these. Okay, you guys see that? Read that for me. What does that say? I mean, it's backwards, but this says, it's funny because <laughs> the name is Fruffalo? Fruffalo Wings? <laughs> they got the nerve to say original. Fruffle, Fruffalo, like Buffalo, but Fruffalo Wings. That is so funny to me. And that's how they're supposed to look. And these are crispy vegan sausage wings with a spicy buffalo sauce. Okay, so that's weird. So I just want to show you guys. Here are the wings that I've already cooked. You're supposed to cook them in the oven for 15 minutes. And then you're supposed to heat up the sauce that comes with them, the spicy buffalo sauce, which I've already done. And you're supposed to pour these into the sauce. Okay. And mix that around. This is going to be really, really weird. I have never, ever seen anything like this. <laughs> it's amazing that they actually did this. Okay, they've probably already been out. And I'm just now seeing them. Who knows? But we've got to find out what they taste like trying to look like wings but they look very funny to me so this is something that I am definitely trying for the first time guys and I just wanted to share this moment with you guys okay so how do they look now they smell like wings because of that buffalo sauce that's what that is that buffalo sauce is doing that all right, so I'm about to give this a, a go, guys. I'm about to give it a try. Look at that. It's still smoking. Okay, what does it look like to you guys? <laughs> That's so funny. Have some. Okay, so here goes. First time tasting this. Mm. It's okay. <laughs> Want to give it a try? Yeah. Tastes all right. <laughs> you want to give it a try? Sure. Mm. This is spicy. What do you guys think? It's good. I think it's good. It's mm -hmm. all right. They like anything. <laughs> but no, it probably is good. It's okay. I guess. <laughs> Alright guys. We're going to see. Let Gabby taste this and see what it tastes like. It's alright to me. Mm. <laughs> tastes like a veggie wing. Tastes like wing with veggie. Yep. Mm, interesting. It's okay. It definitely tastes like a veggie wing. Mm -hmm. No doubt about That's that. amazing how they did it. <laughs> yes, oh, it is. You want to get them all the time. <laughs> uh -oh. Gabby want to continue to get them. Mm -hmm. You want to taste it? Sure. All right. Guys, so here's Queen Jamie. Hey, guys. Go ahead. Give okay. it a taste. Mm. Just good. You real. said that real fast. You didn't mm -hmm. even give yourself time to no. chew it good. I like the sauce on it though. Yeah. It's good. Yeah, so it's okay. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. Now it's Queen Nana's turn. Yep. Everybody gonna get a go at this. Yep. Oh, she ate the whole mm. thing too. She didn't even test it. Mmm. It's good. It's good. I like the sauce. Mm, okay. Everybody love that sauce. It, it's it's about the veggie. 
wing. But they pretty okay. I can deal with it. I do want to get them again. So, we're going to go with this. Thumbs up all around the house, guys. Okay? So, <laughs> yes. Alright. And that's it, guys. Alright, guys. That's what I wanted to share with you guys. So, it's a thumbs up all around once again on the veggie chicken wings with buffalo sauce. Okay. So, I'm going to buy different sauces and try it in different sauces myself or whatever. So, we're going to just kind of work with that. And, um... You guys can give it a try. You know, it's next door to the Morning Star section in the healthy food department. Okay. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog right here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Okay. So, we have more coming at you. Coming at you strong, guys. Stay tuned. Love you guys so much. And I'm going to see you guys next time. Take care. Live, love, and laugh out loud, guys.